In today's video, we'll explore the certification, homologation services, and TSE approval provided by the Automotive Research Association of India, better known as ERAI. For certification guidance, contact MindSync. MindSync is a professional organization providing compliance, consulting, legal, and advisory services. Let's get started by understanding ERAI certification is. The Automotive Research Association of India holds a pivotal role in the Indian automotive industry as one of the foremost agencies authorized to conduct vehicle testing and certification. A mandate set under Rule 126 of the Central Motor Vehicle Rules of 1989. Established in 1966, ARAI was founded through a collaborative effort between the Indian automotive industry and the Indian government. Today, it stands as India's largest automotive research and development organization, offering a wide range of certification and homologation services for vehicles, systems, and components. The Automobile Industry Standard Certification, which forms a critical technical standard within India, was mandated by the Central Motor Vehicle Act of 1989 to ensure uniform safety, emissions, and quality compliance across automotive components and vehicles. The certification processes uphold India's commitment to maintaining a high benchmark for automotive innovation, safety, and environmental compliance, making it essential for automotive manufacturers looking to operate and thrive within the Indian market and beyond. Does a RAI certification mandatory? Yes, in India, obtaining a RAI approval is mandatory for all types of vehicles, including two-wheelers, three-wheelers, and four-wheelers. The ARAI clearance is essential to ensure that vehicles meet the safety, environmental, and performance standards as per regulatory requirements. Without ARAI approval, vehicle manufacturers cannot proceed with production or commercial release within the Indian market, making it a critical step in the vehicle manufacturing process. Vehicle types eligible for the AR AI accreditation. Two wheelers. India leads the world in the production of two wheelers, manufacturing everything from scooters and mopeds to motorcycles. ARAI certification applies to two wheeled vehicles that meet certain criteria. Vehicles with engines above 25cc using petrol, diesel, CNG, or LPG. Electric vehicles with a top design speed over kilometers per hour and power output exceeding 250 watts. Next, three-wheelers. Three-wheelers are widely popular in India, especially in urban areas, due to their simple design and ease of use. Manufacturers develop these vehicles to meet local demands. The following categories of three-wheelers qualify for a RAI certification. Vehicles used for passenger or cargo transport. Fully constructed vehicles. Drive away chassis incomplete vehicles, vehicles with engines above 25cc in petrol, diesel, CNG, or LPG, electric vehicles with speeds above 25 km per hour and power over 250 watts. Next four wheelers that are eligible for ARAI certification include vehicles for transporting passengers or goods, fully assembled vehicles, drive away chassis incomplete vehicles. Vehicles with engines above 25cc using petrol, diesel, CNG, or LPG. Electric vehicles. Next, agricultural tractors. Agricultural tractors serve multiple purposes beyond farm work, including transport. These tractors are covered under CMVR standards to ensure compliance. Next, construction equipment vehicles. CEVS, although not intended for general transportation, occasionally operate on public roads. To meet the Central Motor Vehicles rules, they are certified for design safety and pollution standards. Next, let's look into the process of obtaining ARAI certification. Identify engine or model family begin by identifying the vehicle's engine or model family according to ISO 81787 guidelines. The authorized agency makes the final determination on the engine and model family. Next is type approval application. The supplier submits a type approval application to the certification agency as required by Rule 6 of GSR 771E and its amendments. This approval is essential to ensure the manufacturer's conformity of production. Next complete application form. The applicant fills out the type approval application form based on the vehicle type, referring to annexures IINB. Required details include the parent model, test results, 
and other specifics. Review and Classification The certification agency reviews the application to verify the family, parent model and variants listed by the applicant. Testing of parent model once the model details are confirmed, the certification authority proceeds with testing the parent model. Family verification for the application under review, the authority checks whether it belongs to the family of an already certified model. Emission level assessment, the agency requests an engine sample to conduct emission testing. Grant of type approval certificate, if the engine passes the testing, the ARAI certificate is granted. If not, modifications, repairs or replacements must be completed within three months. Otherwise, a new application is required. Next, let's look into the timeline. Indian manufacturers typically receive certification within one month, while overseas manufacturers may expect it in two months. What about validity? The type approval certificate remains valid for five years from the date of issuance. Now, what is TAC approval? A type approval certificate is a conformity certification granted to automotive products that meet regulatory compliance, technical specifications, and safety standards. TSC approval ensures that a product complies with all necessary standards for quality and safety, confirming its readiness for the market. Homologation certification, on the other hand, is the process of certifying vehicles for roadworthiness in line with government requirements for all vehicles manufactured or imported into the country. Through homologation testing, vehicles are verified to meet established safety and performance criteria, ensuring they are safe and suitable for road use products covered under TAC category. Automotive electronics, gasoline tanks, safety glass, tires, seat belts, brake hoses, lights, batteries, and door locks are examples of products that fall under this category. TSC approval is applicable for a producer of such product or a participant in the production process, importers or dealers who purchase a product from a foreign producer. A foreign manufacturer has its business in India and is involved in trading activities. Need help for a RAI certification? Contact MindSync for expert advice. Like, share and subscribe and hit the bell icon for more such informative content.